Hey, Cyber Heroes. Yesterday, Meta, yes, Facebook, Instagram, had a huge security breach yesterday that impacted millions of people. And in this video, I'm going to tell you exactly what you need to do to protect yourself, your personal information from a security perspective. And if you stick around to the end, I'll teach you how to monetize this problem as well. Let's go. Hey, Cyber Heroes. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Boyd Clueless, internationally recognized cybersecurity expert, and I help people upgrade their jobs to a six-figure tech career. Like this video and subscribe because I'm about to hit you with that fire. Let's go. All right, Cyber Heroes. Here's what we know. Yesterday around 10 a.m. Eastern, a security event happened at Meta, which impacted Facebook, Instagram, as well as the other Meta applications and products that immediately logged people out of their accounts and they were not able to log in, including yours truly. I was scrolling on my phone when I was supposed to be working, but you know how that is. I was logged out of my phone and I couldn't get back in. Let me know in the comments if that happened to anybody else out there. And so what we come to realize is for a couple hours, service was completely down from Meta and all of its services that it offers, social networking, business services, et cetera. Now you may be thinking like, boy, why are you even talking about this? If you followed me for any amount of time, you know what I teach, manage your career like a business. There's the reactive IT guy and there's the proactive business technology professional that gets paid the big bucks when it comes to cybersecurity. So this is something that you definitely want to be aware of because there's a couple things where it impacts you. So number one, it's like I promised at the top of the video, what you need to know and do personally. Since we don't have a lot of information about what kind of security event happened, we can't say for certain whether or not your information has been compromised. So what I definitely recommend for you to do right now is to change your meta password. Even though you may believe it's long and complex and you have multi-factor authentication, just change it, just change it. Trust me, trust me. The second thing that you wanna do is you want to enable multi-factor authentication. Maybe also mentioned as two-factor authentication. What this will do is it will send you a token or a text message to put in an additional number after you log in with your username and password, which will help you in the event that your password is compromised. Because again, we do not know the extent of this meta security event. So those are the things that we want to do to keep you protected personally. Now here's where the money making opportunity comes in right here. And I am excited about this. I know that sounds bad, but I'm not excited that they got breached. But here guys, as a cybersecurity professional, what you saw yesterday is what I deal with every single day for businesses around the world. And what you have to do in order to be successful is understand the nature of the business. Cyber events are going to happen to companies every single day, and they're going to affect companies of all sizes. There's one principle that the foundation of cybersecurity is built on, and it's called the CIA. That's confidentiality, integrity, and availability. And this mass disruption that Meta had yesterday completely, completely took out the A in availability. Services were not available. So it is a security incident. Oftentimes people think that cybersecurity is just about hacking and coding, but it's also about protecting systems so they are up and available when people like you need the platform. Because what most people don't consider is there are several online businesses, including yours truly, who uses Meta to run advertisements to generate income and clients for our businesses. So you have billions, and not, not millions, billions of small businesses around the world that are unable to take advantage of the services that they use for Meta because the service is down. And these days, there's several businesses that don't even have traditional websites. They take orders, they communicate with their customers via Facebook and Instagram. So that two hour blip that Meta had literally took businesses down for hours, which means financial impact. As a business technology professional, it's your job to add value, to help companies come up with backup plans and to look for those single point of failures that can put you in that situation. A guy told me back in 2014 that I used to work with, I was working as a tech guy. He said, Boyd, remember this, 
two is one and one is none. What I mean by that is if I have a redundant website, I have two of them. If one goes down, I still have one. But if I only have one website and it goes down, I have nothing. Redundancy is key. So what I would do if I were you, cyber heroes, I would use this lesson as an opportunity to present to my current employer, or maybe if you're feeling a little entrepreneurial, to develop a relationship with a new company and highlight this issue that happened. It may seem just like a social networking site went down, but it's way bigger than that. We're talking about security disruption, service disruption, loss of money, and potentially loss of reputation for the small businesses that are using Meta's platform to run their companies. So guys, that is what being a cyber hero is all about. And that's why I'm so excited about this opportunity that we have in cybersecurity. It's not just about computers and technology. It's about protecting people's businesses and their livelihood. And this is the opportunity that you have to become a cyber hero because these type of hacks, I'm telling you guys, they happen every single day, regardless of the company size. Let me know what questions do you have about this video? Do you have any questions about the meta outage? I am going to be following up with my resources to see what additional information comes from it. So guys, definitely remember, change those passwords, take action on this because this could be a big money generator from you. Like this video if you got some value from it. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.